Hello. Good morning. Um, oh my god, is there a way to not be ugly right now? Today I'm doing a full day in the life. Like, what do I do in a day? Oh, hello. It'll be a very realistic day in the life. So, right now, I'm still in bed. It's 10 a.m. My boyfriend just walked, like, brought our dog out and I usually stay in bed until he comes back in and then I'm like, okay, I'm up. This is the beautiful face he gets to see every morning. Aren't you so jealous? While he brings a dog out, Belle and I cuddle. And then, yeah, I'm gonna get up and we're gonna go to the gym. Looking cute. First I do my morning skincare. I know some of you are appalled that I sleep until 10 a.m. But listen, as you'll see if you watch till the end of the video, my boyfriend works until 11 p.m. So we don't go to bed until like 1.30 because we like to hang out when he gets home. So I'm gonna get my full eight hours. I end up being in bed till 10, but that's okay. We all have our own sleep schedules that work best for us. And this is just where we're at. You know? Belle, you want some food? So next I feed my children. Want some food? And then I have a Walter White moment and make my intro workout drink, my pre-workout, and my BF's pre-workout. This is just one of my relationship duties. He takes out the trash. I make us pre-workout every day. And I put the creatine in there. All kinds of stuff. So... Is it good? It is. <laughs> Workout is done. I'm currently eating my post-workout meal. I just made lentils and I'm drinking a little shake. Next, I start my work. So it's two o'clock. Two o'clock is when I start my work day. Usually I'll answer a few check-ins, a few clients throughout the morning and at the gym and stuff. But my true like getting down to business work starts now. So I usually make some coffee. So that's what I'm doing right now. So the coffee I'm using is this coffee over cardio kind. It is really, really delicious. It's like my favorite coffee at the moment. I'm just gonna make a pot of this and get to work. Look at my shirt, it's a cat with a mm, Ouija board. Creepy and cats, all my favorite things in one shirt. Thanks, thrifting. I have a little acute office that I do work in part of the day, but lately I've just been like literally standing at this counter and doing it because if I stay sitting too long in one place, I get a little lethargic, so I like kind of standing up. And you'll see me sending voice memos to all my clients in response to their check-in, and I like to kind of pace around while I do that. It also helps me get steps in, helps me not get lethargic or anything, keeps me on task. That's a long explanation for why I'll be doing work standing in my kitchen. Anyways. Hello, beautiful. Thank you so much for sending a check-in last night. to me that some of you might not know what I do. I just like assume everyone knows everything about me. Yeah, this video is kind of a mess, but it's, you know what, it's fine. Whenever you start a video, it's still in bed, you know that you're missing stuff. Like, what is this angle that I'm trying to do right now? Is this good content? No. <laughs> 
Hello, I'm a personal trainer. I work for myself. I do it all online. I have clients that send me check-ins via WhatsApp and then I send them voice memo responses and adjust their macros and send them new workouts. That's what you've been seeing me do is answer clients, send workouts, stuff like that. Also, in every single video, I always have a link to send an inquiry for coaching. So if that sounds like something you'd want to like be a part of, just a quick plug. Hello. This is Alexis Gidry. Calling. I'm calling to let you know that I have openings for new clients. I'm doing great on steps, just like freaking pacing around. Been working for a couple hours now. I have a few more workouts to send, a few more clients to get to, and then I'm gonna stop filming myself just pacing around now, but I'll let you know when something happens. Hello, it's 6.30. I've been working, eating a couple snacks. I relocated to my cute little desk. Isn't it so cute? That plan is holding on for dear life. Where am I? I need water. And now it's time to go walk Maya. You wanna go for a walk? Maya, you wanna go for a walk? Come on. Ready? Let's go. Now I'm actually going back to the gym to do cardio because I'm at the end of my mini cuts and I don't like using like the gym time I have with my boyfriend to do cardio. I like lifting with him. Since I have the luxury of being able to go again later in the day, I just go later in the day to get my cardio done. Plus I like having some food in my system to go back because I really start to feel depleted by the end if I do lifting and then cardio and then I'm in there for a long time. I'm going back, I'm gonna do 30 minutes on the stairs, gonna watch some YouTube while on there. Just hope for the best. I'll talk to you guys after. Hi, Maya. I'm home. Come up here. Hi, Belle. Nice to see you. <laughs> Okay, love you. I'm home and I'm sweaty, so I'm gonna go take a shower and then make food. I've been marinating tofu all day. Pretty pumped about that. Okay, bye. Hello. Did my skincare, so I'm truly looking like a glazed donut. I pretty much look like shit for like 95% of this video, so um, subscribe. I live in a super dry, what? Why? I live in a super dry area in Denver, Colorado. The amount of hydrating products I put on my face really have me shining at the end of the day. The sizzling you may hear in the background, here it is my tofu. It's barbecue tofu, okay? I'm pretty excited. I marinated it in this like unsweetened barbecue sauce that I got at Sprouts. It's my first time trying it. I coated it in a light layer of cornstarch and I'm sauteing it so it gets nice and crispy. You hear that? That's the sound of crisping going on. I'm roasting some cauliflower as well. And then I'm gonna get back to work. I'll let you know when, um, when, when, something, else, when something else happens. Okay. Need salt, but it's good. Okay, so now I'm just working and watching Bojack Horseman. Oh, wow! That is relatable! While waiting for boyfriend to get home. Is anyone else like, a Bojack head and really sad that this is the last season so you're like savoring it and taking a really long time to watch it because I am. Let me know. Bojack fans, come through. It's the best show ever. Like I kind of mentioned before, my boyfriend works from 2 to 11 and I like to hang out with him when he gets home and that's why our sleep schedule is a little 
pushed back. What I make sure to do is before he gets home, I make sure I have my steps done. I make sure I have my gallon of water in and I make sure I have all my check-ins and workouts sent. I'm done with almost all my client stuff. So I also use this time to get back to recent client inquiries. If I'm emailing back and forth with any potential clients, anything like that, I'll do right now. And if I have like any video clips such as these clips to send to my editor I will do that as well just tying up loose ends so it is 8 45 right now I'll probably work until probably have work until about 10 30 ish and then just chilling with my girl Maya Maya love you and my girl Belle if she'd ever wake up I'll touch base when Aaron cutie pie Aaron gets home that's it that's my day this is a pretty typical day for me i know not thrilling at all this is why i don't do vlogs i struggle with thinking that these are very boring with being self-employed and everything i've had a few requests of like what a typical day looks like for me so this was it some days i will go out to a coffee shop and work or I'll go meet a friend for coffee and work with her. Some nights, some evenings, I'll go hang out with a friend, go get dinner with someone, whatever. The biggest thing I struggle with with being self-employed is getting depressed. It's very easy for me to just stay in my house. It's really easy. I'm very introverted. I could chill here for days and be good. So I have to do little tricks to get me out of the house. I only get a very finite amount of groceries at a time. So I have to leave the house to go get groceries. I go to the gym with my boyfriend. I would go to the gym anyway, but that's not enough to keep me from getting into a depressed place. Whenever it's sunny outside, I make sure to take Maya on walks and stuff. So yeah, I do my best, but something I really, really struggled with when I first started is depression. Oh, and also like standing and working helps me because I would just sit on my couch and work with the TV on and that's just like a recipe for depression. Anyways. I hope this was somehow entertaining for you. Thank you for watching. You truly didn't have to and you did anyway. Thank you for all the positive feedback on my most recent video on The Biggest Loser. If you haven't watched that, you should because I'm still fired up about that. Like this video, subscribe. I have some good informative videos coming up soon and I just got an order in from Garage Clothing and I'll be doing an honest review of the stuff that I got. Yeah, I got some fun stuff coming. Time to go out, go, um, oh my God. Time to hang out with my boyfriend who's changing right now. We've been watching Survivor reruns like we started at the very beginning. Any Survivor heads too. Another amazing show. We've been re-watching all the seasons from the beginning. We're on season 17 now. And so we do that together after we catch up. Yeah, we just kinda, we just hang out until 1.30 a.m. Anyways, good night. Love you. That kiss did not go towards you, it went like towards the ceiling. But, okay. Anyways, bye.